Uh, I'm Brian Hayes, the creative director on EA Sports UFC. So let's talk a little about how UFC has been expanding since launch. Uh, it's been expanding a whole lot. You know, uh, ever since the game launched, uh, both the gameplay team and the art team, we've been delivering almost on a monthly cadence, like new DLC fighters for free, as well as a lot of gameplay improvements, additions, and updates. So new animations, new logic, you know, tweaking the game in response to what the fans are telling us from playing the game. So are, we've been hard at work ever since launch. What are some examples of tweaks or, or additions you've done through fan feedback? Uh, well, I mean, change, we've changed the way takedowns work in some situations, um, you know, bringing in uh, sort of more of a metagame to do with fatigue. So if you're if you're tired and you hit a takedown, you only, you only get in to go to, say, a, uh, full guard or you might get to half guard if you have higher stamina we, there's catching kicks um, there's a new sort of uh, uh, striking combo bonus to sort of really pay off people that are, are good at striking um, I mean you'd have to go back through the patch notes and just look at the litany of line items that uh, that basically list all the all that stuff we've done to change gameplay add animations positions and then improve things um, I'm, I'm thoroughly impressed with the job the team has done um, you know in order to, to update the game uh, post launch it's it's been uh, I couldn't be happier about it now we're here at PlayStation experience in Vegas and you guys actually have some fighters here talk a little about how you guys have been interacting with fans with them uh, well here at the PlayStation PlayStation experience we've had a couple fighters yesterday Chuck Liddell was here uh, Matt Hughes is here today uh, Misha Tate's gonna be coming by later they're just here you know um, meeting and greeting fans signing autographs taking pictures uh, and doing some interviews with press as well talking about you know what it's like to be in the game um, and uh, you know letting people know about the Legends DLC pack which is coming December 10th which is pretty big news Talk a little about the Legends DLC pack and what that adds to the experience. Well, I mean, it adds four of the biggest names in, in UFC history, uh, arguably. I know there's some, you know, discussion about that on, online, but uh, Mark the Hammer Coleman, Matt Hughes, uh, Rampage Jackson, and Brock Lesnar um, are going to be available free DLC uh, December 10th. Now you mentioned Amisha. Talk a little about the, the female fighters and what they bring to the table in the video game. Uh, well, I mean, it's just pretty. It's pretty cool to see women throw down like that, you know. Uh, and I'm, I'm fairly proud uh, to have female fighters in the game, and we treat them just like, you know, we treat the male fighters. They, you know, beat the crap of each other, get bloody, uh, choke each other out, knock each other out. Um, you know, I, I, I've, I had, I've had press ask me before when we announced we were putting women in the game. They asked me questions like, oh, "So are they going to bleed just like?" And we're like, "Yeah, they're going to bleed." If you watch a Misha Tate versus Katzengano or Katzengano versus, you know, uh, can't remember who she fought that, but I mean, like, these are bloody affairs. These women get in the ring and they throw down, and I would be scared to death to step into even a training situation with them. So uh, it's pretty cool, you know, uh, with what the UFC is doing, uh, expanding the women's divisions uh, and bringing some really fantastic, uh, fantastic athletes into the sport. Uh, yeah, it's just awesome to see.